Hey fam! Hey fam! So what are we gonna make today, Shiloh? So, bakit kami gagawa ng Play-Doh? It's Corona season and marami sa inyo nabobor sa bahay and lalo na pag meron kayong kids with you, you always have to keep them busy and lalo na, syempre gusto mong bawasan yung screen time nila. And, not yet, because yesterday, nagbigay ng um, homework yung teacher ni Shiloh that they have to make some Play-Doh pero unfortunately, medyo mahirap yung ingredients ng bigid ni Guy. Meron pang cream of tartar and you have to cook it. And this one's an easier recipe na nang galing sa two of my momshi friends na si Race and Thea. So this is a lot easier. I haven't tried this out, pero we'll see how it goes. Okay? Can you tell me what we need? First off, we need... Flour. Flour. Then we need sesame oil. It's not sesame oil. It's vanilla. Vanilla oil. Vanilla essence. We are using many Or kung gano karami yung One, gusto niyong gawin. One, two, three, four, four. And what's this? You need toothpicks kasi yung food coloring namin, it's the gel type. So ito yung mga pinanggagawa ko ng cake. So you can't just pour it out. Kailangan mong itusukin ng toothpick para hindi masayang. Mm, oh, I like the smell. Matukhang ka dyan. <laughs> yes. How about this? What is it? What is this? Oil. Oil. One. And Water and how about this? Do you know what this is? Measuring cup. And yung mga ingredients na to, madaling makuha sa supermarket, especially now na for sure na hihirapan yung iba na bumili ng mga groceries, lalo na sa Philippines na naka lockdown. So these are ingredients that you have. Meron ka sa bahay. So you just need a cup of flour, one fourth cup of salt, one teaspoon vegetable oil. Food coloring or set. Tapos kailan mo din ng scent. Kung mer optional naman to. Kung meron ka lang mga scent na gusto ng ilagay and a bit of water. So tancha tancha lang po yung water. So are you ready, honey? I'm ready. It's on your head already. Again, this is our first time making this this recipe. Kasi nasanay ako na niluluto siya. So I think this is a lot easier. Ano ba? Nagkaya ko na lang. Kaya tanggal ka na sa panggol. Can we start? At saka kasi, pinag-aaralan nila Shiloh ngayon sa school is measuring. So it's a good way of helping your kids learn how to measure and follow simple instructions, right? Can you turn on your listening ears? Listening ears on. Okay. So, you need to calm down. First, breathe in. Siyempre, pakalmahin niyo yung mga anak niyo. Breathe out. <coughs> Again. Breathe in. Breathe out. Para sa inyo din to, mga moms. Kasi, siyempre, pag gagawa kayo nito, dapat handa yung pasensya niyo. Kasi kayo din yung magliligpit nito pagkatapos eh. Dapat, breathe in, breathe out. So, first, can you say, we need one cup of flour. So I'm gonna pour it, Shiloh, okay? So I think you can use any type of flour that's available sa inyong bahay. So we are using all-purpose flour because that's all we have. Mga mamshis, if you have, don't touch it yet, if you have an art smock for your kids, let them put it on kasi syempre ikaw din maglalaba nito after. Gusto mo naman malinis sila. Para naman di sila mukhang espasol after. Okay, put it on! Kasha pa ba sa'yo? Hahaha. Hanging. Ayan. Crop top. I want to do it. I want to. Okay. Can you pour it? Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Pour it on the bowl. We'll just use the same thing because this is one cup anyway. So, tansya-tansya na lang ng one fourth. Okay? Mommy, what is next? I want to put. Okay. Wait, wait. Honey, not yet. Ha? So, you need salt. So, this is purely edible na Play-Doh, which your kids can play with. So, pag nakain nila, okay lang yun. Hindi siya yung toxic na Play-Doh. And then, you need to put vegetable oil. 
you need 1 teaspoon of vegetable oil. So, siguro mga ganyan yung 1 teaspoon, no? Or, sige, dagdagan natin. Para sure. Yan. Next is you need to put water. Tansya-tansya lang yung water. Kasi we don't want our Play-Doh to be so watery. Thank you. Kids love playing with Play-Doh, pero you also don't want to spend that much on buying yung mga, yung mga branded Play-Dohs that are slightly expensive. Tapos mamaya na lang natin lagyan ng food coloring kasi ihihiwa-hiwalay na lang natin siya. Because if you do it now, then lahat siya magiging one color lang. Eh, you wanna use different colors na, di ba? It's a bit dry. So, kung mapapansin nyo, look at, if you check the dough, it's still a bit dry. So, just keep adding more sa kung anong palagay nyo okay. It's on your, based sa own preference. So, yan. You just keep making, ano, masa-masa. And if you would notice, after a while, the texture is still a really so, mine is still a bit grainy, so you'll still see particles of salt. Mommy, so, if that happens, just add a tiny bit of water and Mommy, i masa nyo lang siya. Mas smooth na yung Play-Doh namin ngayon. See, if you know, look at the texture, talagang Play-Doh na Play-Doh na siya. It's soft. Can I check yours, honey? Not yet! Wait, wait, wait! Because I need to put together, and then we're gonna put color. We're gonna use four colors, diba? Oh, we forgot to add vanilla. And the beans. Put it together. Kalimutin and smell it. Mm. Oh la la. Ay! <laughs> it smells good, but it's not good. I want it to smell so good. So I'm gonna add in vanilla. You can add essential oils or whatever. Kung Gusto nyo yung shalan, o oh, pwede mga lavender, lavender scent, oh, chamomile, mga ganun. Pero kami, vanilla lang kasi nyo meron kami. Now we're gonna add the color. Are you ready? Okay. Kung meron kayong cling wrap, just use it while you add the color kasi if your if your um, table is white, ayaw nyo naman na magmancha yan sa table nyo. So, ayan. So, since we have four colors, we're just gonna half it, um, divide it into four even parts. Ayan. Even na ba? Is it even? Do you think it's all the same size? Yeah. What do you think? This one's a bit small. Okay, are you ready? So, I'm gonna add color. So, siguro, ano, lagyan yung hole in the middle, like that. Yung gel food coloring kasi, ano to eh. It's really strong. So, yan. Okay, here. So, I don't use that. That's for later. Okay, now you need it. And then, tignan nyo yung color kapag lumabas na. And depende sa inyo if you wanna add more or not. So, okay, can you do it? Actually, ang bango niya, in fairness. Since I used the vanilla, it smells so good. So, Gusto ko sana yung kalabasan is a bit pastel-like in color. Put it in the middle, and then you fold it. You do it like this. Mm, like that. Yee, I'm so excited. Medyo matagal siyang gawin. It takes... I don't know. Siguro kung magaling ka mag ganito. Ta-da! It's softer in texture now. So we just added a bit more water hanggang maging so soft siya and mawala yung mga graininess nung salt. So after you've made the plato, hindi siya one time lang, then you throw it out. So you can keep it by putting it in a Ziploc bags or um, Tupperware na airtight. So para hindi siya mahanginan and you can keep it for a while. Pag sa tingin nyo na hindi na siya pwede, then you just chuck it out in the bin. And we're done. See you again next time.